How's the mood in the camp? Are you feeling the external pressure at all? Yeah, the mood in the camp is still very good. Um, I think naturally there's some external pressures and um, you know, be naive to say, oh, we've you know, got our blinkers on and, and uh, are not aware of, of um, things that are going on outside or, or the pressure of the tournament. Um, so I think we just have to accept those things. That that's what's going to happen during tournament cricket. Um, we know we're in the, um, the situation we're in. Um, nothing's changed. We're still a very good side. And, and when we play our best cricket, that um, you know it gives us the best chance of winning. So um, we know we didn't perform well enough in the previous two games to be beaten, um, but we've still got the, the opportunity to put that right. And, and the guys turned up with lots of smiles on their face and, and ready for a big week. Johnny Bairstow and Michael Vaughan have had a little bit of a tit for tat. Uh, is there a danger that that can distract from things on the pitch? <laughs> Just typical Yorkies, is it? <laughs> um, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I haven't really seen what's what's gone on. I've been trying to sort of just get on with it. Um, but um, I think just from um, that way, I talk about goodwill and people wanting you to do well. I think it's been great from the from the country and and uh, everyone wanting. It seems from my opinion, um, you know, everyone has re been really behind the team and, and wanting us to do well. And and naturally, I think. Um, you know, being such a good side, uh, when we don't perform to that um, level, it can it's frustration, and, and people, um, you know, in the media or whatever, you know, given the, their opinion, and, and can and frustrated that we're not playing as well as we are frustrated um, as individuals and, and as a team as well. So, um, but I think there's been lots of goodwill of you know walking down the street, people wishing you well, and guys hanging out their van saying good luck for for Sunday. So that's uh, good signs for me. We know that we're going to be, whether we're favourites or underdogs, is they're going to be very hard matches, um, especially against teams like India, a, a great side um, who we know are, are brilliant. So, um, but does the favourites and underdogs? I don't think it means too much. I think for us, we need we know we need to play better, and we know we're capable of playing better, uh, and we look forward to the challenge of, of facing a really strong Indian team. And that's that's the reason we play the game. You know, we're in a very privileged position to to be able to take part in a, in a game like Sunday. Um, it's a massive occasion. Um, you know, you talk about pressures and external pressure. You know, Pressure's a privilege sometimes. We're in a very privileged position to, to be in this situation. Um, and these are the games that, you know, you look back on in your career or at the start of your career, you do hope you're involved in these games. Um, and it's going to be a great occasion. Um, we know the, f the support the Indian side will get. The, um, wherever they go in the world, they get great support. Uh, and we hope we'll get some great support as well. And, and it's going to be a great game. This is a, a one-off game in a World Cup, and um, you know we know lots about their side. We've, you know, like you say, someone like Cool Deep in that series that we hadn't faced a lot. Um, you know, having seen him in the first game, um, you know, we came back well to, to um, against him. Um, but uh, yeah, it's, it's a one-off game. It's going to be a great occasion. Um, as you say, the, one of those games that gets your, your juices flowing against um, you know, a fantastic India side. So we're we're very excited.